Hello. Welcome to the Chattiest Show. That's me. Welcome to the Chattiest Show. Welcome to the Chattiest Show. Let's eat. Welcome to the Chattiest Show. Hello, everybody out there in YouTube, bro. Today we are having some steak. See it? And here is some. I hope it don't spill. I try to put the sauce on the side. <laughs> some rice and beans and this is a california blend so i guess that's cauliflower carrots let me see broccoli okay and that's my gravy so it don't spill again okay okay all right so before we dig in let us pray thank you jehovah god for waking me up this morning and blessing me with this food on my plate through your son jesus christ amen all right here we go i'm excited i want to eat eat let's see what i'm gonna eat first How's everybody doing out there in YouTube world? How's my chatty friends? I'm too hot. I'm too happy. Hold on. I'm going to put this right here for a minute. And I'm going to put some of this through the hair on my plate. Okay. So it's going to be kind of mixed up a little bit. But that's all right, though. I got my olives up in there. The black beans and rice. The black beans are good. I was going to use the pink ones. I wasn't sure, so. Let's just see. Uh, hold up, hold up. Look at that steak. Look at that steak. That steak look good, dog. Okay, let me stop. All right, I'm doing too much again. Sorry. Okay, so here we go. I'm trying to see what side I should put this on. Okay, so maybe I should put this here. Can you see this without it spilling out? Okay, that's everything. Look how nice that look. All right. So let me see if I can move this over a little bit. Right, here's a little bit of gravy. Because every time I do it, it spills out somewhere. So there we go. Got my gravy. This is so in the way. I'm trying to move it over. Well, here's my hot sauce. I'm going to figure out which one I'm going to use. I think I'm going to try this one. My West Indian pep. My face feels funny. I'm so used to wearing a mask. It just feels weird. If ever took the mask off and I feel like it's still on your face, <laughs> that's what it feels like to me. All right, the heat is on in my house, so I'm really hot. So let me let me pat myself up. Let me pat myself up. Okay, I'm doing too much again. Oh, I have my ginger ale. Okay, got me some water. Okay. And let me dig in. I'm just trying to put this in a shot. Can't even see it. Okay, so let's taste this thing. Oh, it's good. Mmm. I like it. Oh, that has so tangy. Mmm. It's good, though. Mmm. So, how's everybody doing in YouTube? Oh. oh. I used to write all the time, like in a diary. I used to write to myself. I know. It's my black me. I uh, wrote some things down. Some uh, stuff about my old me and how the new me is. I'm a reader to you. I wrote it down. This is good, but I'd rather have it without the hot sauce. I just had to taste it with the hot sauce. So, I'm going to eat some of it. I'm going to read this letter. Did I just do that? No, I didn't just do that on tape. I ain't editing it. I don't even care, okay? I missed my mouth. Mm -hmm. Don't judge my hair. It really needs to be done again. I gotta do it. I shouldn't even be touching it while I'm eating, but I can do my hair. I'm trying to figure out my color. I'm gonna put maybe some red. Not bright, raggedy and red, but you know, a little red streaks in it. My braids, so I don't have to do my hair. I'll be having time to do my hair. And I want my hair messy, so. 
I don't know if you still see that scarf on. You know, you put the scarf on. I know everybody wears bonnets, but I still wear the scarf. My kids said it's a do rag. Ha ha. Very funny. Mmm. It's good. It's soft. I saw. I cooked this for a while. This um, broccoli blend, California blend. It's good. Mm hmm Okay. So, because I can't see, I'm going to put my glasses on. To read this to you. So, this is called, um, Dear, Dear Jadia, Letter to My New Self. Okay. It's about getting over, uh, you know, past hurt and trying to forgive people and move on. Something that is really, really hard to do, but you can do it. But everybody is different. Some people write their pain out. Some people listen to music. Some people drink. Whatever. <laughs> Not my business, I'm just saying. Okay? I'm about to read it to you. Give me a second. All right. I'm going to read it. I'm going to put my leg over here. The glasses. I'm trying to situate myself, okay? Okay? All right. So it says, Dear Jadia, letter to, my, letter to my new self. I'm learning to move on and forgive the people who have hurt me in more ways than one. I swore up and down I would never forgive or speak to these people again. Mm -hmm. And years went by, but my mindset has changed. I was no longer mad or hurt when certain people's names came up in a conversation. Instead, I would feel a sense of peace and calmness that would come from within. I still can't pinpoint the actual day I let go. I finally took my life back. I truly moved on. They didn't have any more control of my emotions. I tried to put myself in their shoes to see what made them behave in this manner, but I couldn't. So I prayed on it. I cried on it. I screamed at the top of my lungs. I broke things, but I still was hurting. And one day I woke up and I just let it go. Um, I just let go of my hurt, my pain, my anger. Now I'm a stronger person, but I'm far from being perfect. God is still working on me. I'm still working on me. I wouldn't be who I am today without my life lessons. My life is an open book. I am still having plenty of happy chapters coming towards my way. I learned how to move on. I learned how to let go of the past. And for that, I'm proud of myself. This is my life lessons, my truth, my jotty life, my closure. Yes, that's what I do when I am uh, down. I just write stuff down I'm, with the exception of praying. But that's what I do. When I'm feeling bad or stressed, I write stuff down. And then I come back to it later on. And it uh, you'd be like, wow, you really felt like that. But you know, that's how I feel. I moved on. I don't know how I moved on from certain stuff, but I did. I did. And I am definitely stronger than what I was before. I can't say you can't break me, but I tell you what, I don't need nobody else to help put me back together. I can put myself back together. I don't need to lean on nobody, as I said before in any other videos, to make myself whole. I am whole by myself okay so whoever is depressed or and I said this before feeling sad go write something that actually works when you write down your feelings and you come back later on and be like dang I felt like that it helps me I don't know maybe it could help someone else my kids are actually very good with writing also. That's like their strong point. You no, know, everybody has a strong point.
expressing their feelings. For me, that's me owning up to my truth. I just chose to share it with you. So, because you are my Johnny friend, so I chose to share share with you my letter to myself, to my new self, the things I went through, the things I'm probably going to go through, but you're not going to break me because I know how to prepare me. I don't need no one to prepare me. Okay? With what this on, sometimes you have them little down feelings where you just feel, um, I wouldn't say hopeless, you just feel like you, you're just banging your head into the wall. And it's or either you're like stuck in one spot and you're not going nowhere. So I sit down, I pray, and I write. And it helps me out. And or taking a nap helps too. But anyway, it's <laughs> full this day. And um, I hope everybody's having a great weekend. Um, I hope everybody is in taking good care of themselves. Well, attempting to take good care of themselves. One second. Have a great day, great night, a wonderful morning, and thank God that you woke up because he helped you wake you up. Um, I know there's a lot of food. I cannot eat all of it, but I will see you with another video, but I'm going to end this video. Wait, I'm taking a bite. Hold up. <laughs> I'll see you with another video. So, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I will see you with another video. See you later. Bye.